Welcome back, everyone. And uh, this one was recommended to me, and I have never seen this game before. No idea what's in store, and I don't even know what kind of game this is. So, um, yeah. Oh, oh god, no. I'm not doing this. Look out, the last thing you remember before blacking out was a shadowy figure appearing in the road in front of you. Alright, so this is like deja vu. Uh, you heard your sister cry out as you swerved the car into this tree. You realize that you are alone, and your sister must have gone for help. The smell of gasoline fills the air. You must have punctured the tank. Oh god, get out. We, we have to get out. You pry yourself free of the steering wheel, intent to finding your sister. Um, okay. I wonder if I take too long, if I'll die. Man, this is memo. Self. Save. Um, examine. Did the airbag go? Why didn't the airbag go? The steering wheel has guided you in and out of traffic for a year now. It has a new leather cover on it. Okay, um, is there a glove box? The speedometer has nothing to monitor. This car isn't going anywhere. The front is smashed in and gas is leaking. Okay, um, no. Alright, so I've played a little bit of Deja Vu, so I know that this means I can move left to get out, but I really feel like I'm, I would be missing something. Through this mirror, uh, wait, through this mirror you see the road behind you. Uh, oh, open. Open glove box. It won't open. I can open this. Won't open. Alright, whatever. Uh, leave? Oh, did that like drop? Yeah. That's stupid. Move. Gotta move. You can't go through the door until you open it. Okay. Smartass, open door. The car door opens with some effort. And, uh,. Yeah, as far as going, like, as far as hints in the comments and stuff, if I'm really screwing up, I really don't mind if you guys want to help me out with this, because, uh, well, an explosion erupts from behind you as the car bursts into flames. At least it will save you the cost of a tow. You find yourself standing in front of an old mansion. It gives you the creeps. Okay, um, examine mailbox. It's a mailbox. Could there be mail inside? I know this is a federal offense, but let's check this out. Open the mailbox. Uh, examine the envelope. Could be a bomb, so we don't want to pick it up yet. This envelope is addressed to Master Crowley. Uh oh. Um. Well, let's uh, deliver it to him. All right. Uh, leave. Oh no, that's not what I want. Oh, okay. I can cancel it. Close mailbox. Now. Uh, how far along are we? Oh, we still got plenty of time. Okay, uh, let's examine this envelope some more. Open. Open the envelope. A pendant. It's a pendant with a large jewel set in it. Okay, and hopefully this letter explains a little. This note reads. Dear Master, please forgive me. My health prevents me from aiding you in your battle. 
In your battle against the evil Draken, Draken, uh, you teach your students well. They become too powerful for their own good. Ah. Enclosed is an amulet that should look familiar. Wear this charm and think of me. The undead will surely fear it. Still, the evil, my friend, set uh, set it free for the sake of the family. Fairly well. All right. Uh, can we use pendant? You can't use what you didn't take. Take pendant. Take the pendant. Oh god, no! Wait, oh. And it begins to sparkle, then... The door of the mansion opens... And dares you to enter. Could your sister be in there? Oh, we're looking for our, our sister. Wonder what her name is. Um, alright, self. You can't take it. Um... So memo, memo pads, spell, um, envelope, property, pendant, use pendant. What would you like to use this on? On self? Is that how I do this? Nothing happens. Well, put it on, dumbass. Hit, close, take. Okay, whatever. Um, I doesn't. I don't really see anything else in here, so let's go. As you enter, the door slams shut behind you. All right. I hope I didn't miss anything. Uh, this foyer is a large and luxurious room. Still, it seems strangely oppressive. Yeah. Uh, let's look at some of these paintings or something. It's a painting of a great eagle diving with extended talons. What's this one? It's a painting of a great snake. An eagle, a snake. A small rug barely covers the floor. The couch looks soft. You feel something hard sewn into it. Ah, am I gonna need a knife or can I open that? Open the couch. It won't open. I'm gonna have to find a knife. Oh, let's examine this fireplace real quick. There's dried wood in the fireplace. Probably gonna have to light that eventually. Unlock something or other. Uh, anything in these chairs? This chair looks like it's worth a bundle. And this one, probably the same. Okay, I get it. All right, uh, open this door. Open the door. And you know what? I'm going to make a save state because I don't really want to risk it. Oh, you know, quick save. Shift in one, got it. All right, let's go. This room was designed for deep thought and research. Uh, is there something in the globe? It won't open. Okay. Uh, examine the book. It's a large, ancient book. Um, alright. So, whoa, no, crap. Take book. And, uh, take the ma- oh, magic book. Okay. Uh, let's read it. Examine? No. Or use? And we're getting pretty close to the end here, so maybe I can learn a magic spell and cut off. What would you like to use this on? What? Myself. Nothing happens. Open magic book. Open the magic book. Okay, um, what? Now examine it? A 
about magic in general, magic is not good nor bad. If it is used properly, good may result from it. If it is not used properly, terrible things can happen. Oh, I can. What follows are a few magical spells. From nothing it shall form, and none shall see. Uh, three. Oh, she see thee. Oh, okay. Awake to a sleep. Movement to still. Six legs more. Bend to your will. Stellini. If the path is barred with more than one, the storm to come to make them run. Thunder D. Thunder D. Okay, and uh, oh crap, still learning magic. Okay, come on, magic. From there, uh, all right, whatever. Is it still going? Crap. All right, I memorized the spells. See ya. <laughs>